Hello and welcome to this Land Super vulnerability video. Microsoft recently released a new security advisory detailing a vulnerability in the Microsoft Diagnostics tool. You'll also see this vulnerability referred to as a Microsoft Office vulnerability or zero day. That is because the vulnerability will be exploited using Microsoft Office, but the actual vulnerability is in the Microsoft Support Diagnostics tool. Now, they also have detailed a workaround. There's no fix yet, no official patch yet that you can apply. Um, and it is being actively exploited as well. Um, so it is important that you apply this workaround as soon as possible until a new patch comes around. Now, the actual workaround has to do with a registry key. And luckily with Landsweeper, we're able to scan registry keys. So we'll also be able to use a report to indicate whether a device is vulnerable or not, depending on the registry key and whether it's been found or not. So here we are within Landsweeper in our report. Um, the vulnerability has been dubbed Felina. So that's why you see the Felina name. Um, and we have an overview here of all of our devices along with whether, uh, with an indication and color code that indicates whether this device is vulnerable or not. Now, as I mentioned, this is based off the registry key. So um, in order to quickly show you how this would work, um, I'll actually head over to my command prompt and use the instructions that Microsoft has provided to delete the registry key. And now that we've deleted it, we're going to rescan our device and also show you the result in Landsweeper itself. So back into Landsweeper, we'll head over to the device specific page here, and we're going to rescan this asset. So now that we've done a rescan of the device, we're actually going to refresh the report as well. So I'm gonna refresh there and quickly also sort here by whether it's vulnerable or not. And I can even use the columns at the top to actually filter and search for my machine. So if I enter this filter, they will jump to my machine immediately because that's the only one that fits the condition. And you can see that um, the registry is no longer found. It says here as well on the right hand side, um, this machine is no longer vulnerable to the CVE. So we know exactly which of our devices are vulnerable, which ones are not, simply by scanning the correct registry key. If you wanna grab this report, you can head over to our report library um, where you'll find both some basic information as well as how you configure your LAN Super to be able to scan the registry key and the report itself that you can use to get the same view that I just showed you. If you don't have LAN Super yet, there's a try for free button on the website as well. You can start your free trial um, and get it set up yourself so you can also get the overview even if you haven't had LAN Super in the past yet. So that'll be it. Thank you for watching.